Hi, this is the February project. I got to the last couple of days of February and realised I hadn't done it. So it was a very quick affair. It is one of Rosa Kelly's tutorials and while well worth having a look at her work, I thought it was um, going to be a small album. However, it's pretty chunky, but well worth the work. The paper collection that I've used is Art Deco and it's Docraft Paper Mania. It's from quite some time ago. I bought it because I really liked it and then stored it as we do. So as you can see on the cover, I've just put some flowers, 3D and a nice catch here. I haven't decorated the sides or the back because I don't like to. I just like the front with just a little bit and that's it. So let's open it up. It's got five signature pages. First one here is the gatefold. I match some of the paper sidetrack in here um, just to try to give that Art Deco feature because I enjoyed the paper so much I wanted to use as much as I could. Right, these are magnetized and you can just pop in there. Lots of tuck spaces in this album and plenty, can, there we are, and plenty of space for pictures. And in the side of each page, there is a tuck spot for more photos. And then this little pocket here has got an envelope for you to pop your tags or tickets, whatever, inside. This one here, just pop that in. Of course, you can put photos behind there. And then you've got this very large area for larger photos there and on the back. And then flip that, oh, there we are, inside. Flip that over and you've got the waterfall with plenty of spaces for photos. This flips up, two large photos. I have to keep checking that I've turned it all over. I haven't got used to the album yet. Small page here, but it still comfortably sits a six by four and you could trim down an eight by five easily. A nice little pocket there and again, three spaces for photos. And you've got a nice big tag area at the side. Again, another tuck spot and two large ones. That will take a very nice large photograph. And then again, photos on there and memorabilia in there. This opens up to three nice large ones. And the side pocket in this one, I just, I popped two in just to ring the changes a bit. And then you've got this area upside down with another plenty of photo space, as you can see. That goes right down to there. Nice belly band here, so you could put a huge photo underneath there. And I've just popped a couple of envelopes to put bits and pieces in there. But you could store extra photos in there easily. These three ladies here can all take a photograph. Just tuck them underneath. And then that opens up and you've got space for four. And on the back, you've got this space here. So there's a lot, let's get that the right way. There's a lot of space for photos in this album, as you can see. It certainly holds a lot. It was fun to do.
I did enjoy it and I can imagine it in other paper collections. Thanks for watching. I'm not sure what I'm going to do in March. We'll have to wait and see. Bye.